I'm sitting, it was night, and it was cold, very cold. I just closed my eyes, and it was outside, by the way. Because when you're in hell, no, no, sorry, when I'm in hell, not you, far from you, when I'm in hell, whether inside or outside, doesn't matter really. It's hell. But I thank the Lord for that hell. It was an incredible experience. Now I thank him. I kiss his feet if he allows me. Close my eyes. Freezing winter night. As I closed them, not even a second or two, I saw myself with another saint. And when I say with another, I meant him and the one who came later. Because this person is a sinner. So as I closed my eyes, I saw myself walking with another saint. And we were walking in a desert. And it was dark pitch black dark in the distance but I knew it was a desert because we were the only ones walking as if we were in a bubble of white light and it was in a way it was in the spiritual realm I'm fully alert I'm fully awake and I'm in hell and I saw walking along this saint we were covered in light that is white, whiter than snow. And we were walking in that desert, but as if we were walking in the air, the feet were not touching the ground. And it was like wavy, spiritual. And then this saying that came along, or I walked along with, said to me, we are going to receive the blessing of Saint Bimwa. Now those who are Coptic, those who are Egyptians, they will know this name. I never knew this name. I never knew that there was a saint that existed by this name. Never ever in my entire life till that moment. I will never be able to imagine this, even if I try my hardest. And let me tell you one thing. When I was in hell, there is no way for my intellect to make up such thing or imagine such thing. I was absolutely dead. Absolute hell. Oh my goodness. So unbearable. This was jammed. Finished. Finished was that bad and even much worse and he said we're going to receive the blessings of saint or amba bimwa and as we're walking somebody from that darkness comes out walking in the desert towards us and he comes to my side and as he approaches me a big smile on his face and he wraps me with his arm he puts it around my shoulder and then I open my eyes. For a couple of seconds, I was saying, where am I? And then I came back to my senses. I realized I was in Sydney. That place happened to be real. I went and visited that place on this trip and I met the saint who moved on several years ago he passed away he was a bishop looks like uh, bishops talk to each other huh? when I asked people this the following day this was at night uh, the following day I asked some people I said is there someone called Bimwa Saint Bimwa I said well research they gave me a, a picture of a saint because the, the original saint was in the early centuries. When they showed me that picture or that icon, I said, no, no, no. Then they said, there is another one. He was a bishop and he passed away several years ago, recently. He was a bishop, but he was also a hermit. 
You know what a hermit is? A fly. Oh, man, you have no idea what saints do. Oh, my goodness. Tell me about them. Ask me about them. I tell you. Huh? So, they said he was a bishop, but he passed away several years ago. But they said he was, he was a saint and he did wonders and miracles as well. Oh, the Lord did wonders and miracles through him. When they showed me his photo, I said, this is the man that embraced me. I visited his monastery and I went where they placed his body. I received the blessing of Saint Bishop Bimwa. Wow. 